How you doing there? Long time no talk, you interneters, you. How you doing? Well, now that you're here, we are going to discuss the current destabilization of the global blockchain as it pertains to the numismetric values, or we can watch someone randomly passing gas during a deposition. Someone with one Well, today's episode is our famous mailbag episode. You asked, we're answering. Letter one comes from Lane in Oregon. Lane asks, can you show us some more half-assed assery in the world? Well, sure. Now look at this painting. Really? You couldn't find a frame to fit the left and right side? Half-assed. But what about these cupcakes? This is how they're supposed to look. Here's the easy one to step-by-step -step instructions. Step one, step two, step three, and so on and so on. So finally, they get to look like this. Or, in my case, they don't. You must be asking yourself, why JK Presents do these things exist out in the real world? Well, because we were fed this as children. We were very confused. Are we dum-dums? Are we smarties? Who knows? Letter number two comes from Lewis in Colorado. He asks, I'm trying to get my transitions a lot like your videos. Can you show me some? Sure, here's one. For my transitions, I just use this. Yes, it's a useless season ticket holder uh, silicone frame. And I just swipe it from left to right like this. Look, hold on, ready? Swiping left to right, fast. Now this useless piece is now not useless. Who wrote this? Here's another transition. Yes, I know it was a cheesy transition, but it's kind of an homage to the 1960s Batman series. And what it actually is, my laundry. And question number three comes from Sloan, asking, please show some more randomness. Here you go. You can't get any more random than this. Whoops. Sand castles are easy. Rice castles, on the other hand, are also easy. This is why a lot of people don't like to be mic'd up during a wedding, because you get sounds like this. And this is not edited. This is the, well, just watch the video. I have to go to the restroom, okay? okay. Oh, and our last piece of randomness is this egg hack. It's actually a life lesson. There's a reason why this little circular indention at the end of a handle is placed there. It's because of this. You're welcome. And with heavy hearts, we're sad to say that our mailbag episode is finally coming to conclusion. But please make a comment. Subscribe if you want. The first 15 people get this beautiful International Coin Alliance pamphlet. It's trifold. It um, tells you all about coins. We are ending off with a video from, from the, the archives. archives. And it's just in time for Easter, which here in Texas we call Easter. It's an homage that I did way back in the day to the 1998 film Prince of Egypt. It was an animated cartoon that came out back in 1998. I just said that. I just said that. I was inspired by the, the way it was animated, the way the framing was, the lighting, the visual imagery. And I wanted to mash it up with the hauntingly gorgeous music of Peter Gabriel and a little, little sprinkle of Hans Zimmer. I used three different songs. You can look that up in the description. So anyway, as we say here in Texas, Happy Easter! And remember that the new normal is always an incompletely abnormal. Incompletely. Incompletely. Anyway, please enjoy. It might be a little long one, but it takes its time. It's a slow burn. It tells its story. And it goes back to pacing. We'll see you next time. JK Presents is out. For the greater good, sacrifices must be made. Sacrifices. And
do you understand the task for which your birth has destined you? The ancient traditions. When I pass into the next world, then you will be the morning and evening star. Moses, you will never have to carry a burden like the crown I will pass to Ramesses. He must not allow himself to be led astray. Not even by you, my son. They never told you? Who never told me what? I know who you are, and you are not a prince of Egypt. Miriam. God saved you to be our deliverer. I was their enemy. I was the prince of Egypt, the son of the man who slaughtered their children. You've, you've chosen the wrong messenger. How, how can I even speak to these people? Understand. I am the god of your ancestors. shall send you. In my heart you are my brother, but things cannot be as they were. And I can no longer hide in the desert while they suffer. Your hands. So, you have returned only to free them. No, Ramesses, it is only beginning. God has come to me again, saying, Take a lamb, and with its blood, mark the lintel and posts of every door. For tonight, I shall pass through the land of Egypt and smite all the firstborn. see the blood upon your door, I will pass over you, and the plague shall not enter.
you and your people have my permission to go. Who did all this? Yes. But one must wonder why. Because no kingdom should be made on the backs of slaves. Ramesses, your stubbornness is bringing this misery upon Egypt. It would cease if only you would let the Hebrews go. I will not be dictated to. I will not be threatened. I am the morning and the evening star. I am Pharaoh. Am Pharaoh. Am Pharaoh. Am Pharaoh. Am Pharaoh. Am Pharaoh. The weak link in the chain.